Hey everyone, it's Laura here with Sensibly Southern Chic and I'm very excited about this blog post because I'll be talking about vintage styles. I love vintage items, I love vintage clothing, if they're good quality. Um, I've been known to rummage through a couple of flea markets here and find some fun little pieces to add to my wardrobe to modernize it a little bit. And currently, I am doing a blog post on how you can do that. Half the time when you find vintage clothing, um, you can pay five to $12 for, or maybe less than that, like I did with some of the items that I've bought so far. But I recently have my model here, Millicent. Um, I'm very excited about this purchase, so I don't have to take things on and off just to give you a good idea. But this is Millicent here, my little model. And this little piece right here, this um, skirt, the plaid skirt, I thought was really cool. My mother was cleaning out my uh, grandmother's uh, house and she found this that she wore it in high school. So she knew I could do something with it, so she handed it over to me. And of course, my creative juices started flowing. And I love that bohemian look, that bohemian style. So this is a long skirt, wool, it's got a little wool and cotton to it, so it's a good quality. And remember that, ladies, when you buy vintage clothing, make sure the quality is good and it lasts long and you can wash it. Um, anyway, I'm gonna back it up a little bit. I added my vintage locket for my grandmother, and then I added her belt, my grandmother's belt that she bought to this outfit. Um, I can take it off and show you exactly what it would look like without it. So it just gives it, it just blends the colors and it gives a little more detail when you do that. But I will scoot the, the Millicent back and she's such a good little model. And you can tell the skirt's a little longer and I will eventually have it hemmed for the, um, for fall of next year. Of course, I'm not gonna really be able to wear this now, but I'll have it hemmed for fall of next year. And I wanted to add some fun details to this to kind of modernize it a little bit. I really love the bohemian look, the bohemian chic look. So I found some of my black ankle boots just thought would be perfect with this once I get it all taken care of. Or I could wear these now that the skirt's a little bit longer and I wouldn't have to have it altered. So that's, that's something that you ladies can think about if you really don't have time to get things altered, wear higher boots, that way you can um, elongate it and that way you don't have to go and get it altered at that time, um, spend the money. But anyway, since I didn't spend any money on this other than the shirt from TJ Maxx for $14.99, um, I can do that easily. But I love to add mix my prints and being that um, we have the same colors here in this outfit and there's not really any black in this skirt but it's all the um, contrasting colors that blend, the golds and the blacks all blend together, um, I wanted to add a fun printed scarf, leopard scarf. You don't have to do a print, you can keep the color solid, but I just like to do this and step out of the box a little bit, and I think it's fun. Um, so anyway, I just put my scarf around Millicent. We have the vintage locket, the vintage belt, and the vintage skirt. And then I'll add a fun bohemian hat. Love it, I think it's so much fun. Millicent now has her purse, and she, see how all the colors blend and the styles blend? Even though it's just one color, there's no black in the skirt. Like I said, I just blended it all with the golds and the browns and the blacks. So, this is my vintage look. Read my blog. See how you can find vintage pieces. Look through your mom and dad, your mom's wardrobe um, or your grandma's wardrobe. You never know what you may find, or your dad, you know, depending on men. They may find something vintage there, too, in their closets. Um, but, you know, it's, it's fun to do, it's easy, it's affordable, and um, it is kind of, like I said, every minute, every piece, every item, I'll pull her up closer, every item has a kind of a story behind it. That's what makes it fun. And this is my mother's and this is my grandmother's belt who passed recently and the locket. So it means a lot to me and it means a lot that I can kind of carry on and really add my creativity to this and modernize it a little bit. So anyway, ladies, have fun with your vintage styles. Um, I would love to see your pictures, your looks, of what you got. If you've been shopping um, for some vintage items, I'd love to see it. Or if you have questions on how to style it, just give me a call. Or if you need somebody to come shop with you, I would love to help you. Anyway, have a great day. Enjoy reading my blog. Bye-bye.